everybody welcome 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 we're at Walmart I'm pretty excited for today's haul um, so I need a weekend warrior of five rebates for one dollar which obviously we're gonna hit that and then there is that derby rebate which is kind of eh but I need 24 rebates so I had 48 where I needed 48 I'm at 24 I just need 24 more rebates and I will get a five dollar bonus so I was adding up all the rebates that I have written down we might hit that actually we're gonna hit that so challenge accepted so yes we are at Walmart I'm doing all digital deals except one deal the Purcell I'm gonna try to get the coupon out again um, but one thing I know is what Ibotta is really hard with everything going on right now it says you can't use a coupon but I know a lot of people are submitting the receipts to coupons.com to shop them and stuff and like some people are totally against that and some people are okay with it and some people are d definitely do it I'm okay with it like if it says not to use a paper coupon I'm not gonna use a paper coupon but I'm still gonna submit my receipt um, the reason is because you know times are getting harder these days times are getting harder I can't believe how expensive it is and then there's Ibotta which is nice but like we've been doing Ibotta for like a guy almost hit my car. We've been using like I bought it for eight years at what I have been doing, and I've been stacking all this stuff. Now they're having it where you can't even use coupons, and it's like eventually people will stop using I bought it and it might go away. But there is that. But I'm still gonna submit my receipt to coupons.com, you know, just because it helps me save money. You know, right now we're on a time crunch where we need to save money, so that is what we're going to do. But let's go inside and save some money and have fun shopping. I'm so sad that school's gonna be ending soon and then that means I have to take the kids with me and I don't want to so that means I'll be coming to Walmart a whole lot earlier in the morning before my husband goes to work because I don't like shopping especially at Walmart when I have to do a lot of math in my head but let's go have fun and shop on this actual nice day that we're having today <music> So here we have the Optic White Toothpaste for $9.96, or you could do the $7.96 one, but we're gonna do the $9.96 one. You will end up paying $9.96, but there's actually a couple I bought a, a coupons.com that you can submit your receipt to. So here we have a $5 one that you can submit to this one, or you can submit to the $3 one for this one, but we're gonna end up paying just $9.96. You'll get three, uh, $5 back with coupons.com. And then you get $3 back with Ibotta, making this just $1.96. Now usually we say don't pay for toothpaste, but considering it's $10 and you're getting it for $2, it's a pretty great deal. So here we have the Act mouthwash for $4.12. You're gonna pay for $12 for it, but we currently have a $1 off Ibotta rebate, and you can submit your receipt to coupons.com, making this just $2.12. My stepdad uses this stuff and asks for me to get him some, so I am getting this deal for him. He likes the cinnamon kind, so that is what I am getting for him. So here we have the Poise Pads for $5.97. You're going to pay $5.97 for it, but we have a couple deals that you guys can submit your receipt to. We have Ibotta where you get $3 back with Ibotta. Then you also get, sorry, all my things are gone. You also can submit your receipt for a dollar back with the coupons.com app that does end on Saturday. And then we also get 510 kicks for purchasing and scanning the product, which is $2 and four cents this ends up becoming a seven cent money maker so here we have the kotex liners for two dollars and 97 cents you would pay 297 but we currently have a two dollar ibotta rebate it is a limit of one but you can submit your receipt to ibotta and you can also submit your receipt to the coupons.com app this ends up becoming a three cent money maker So here we're gonna get the Old Spice Body Wash. You do have to get certain scents, but they are $6.97. And then we're also gonna get the Bear Glove um, scent for $6.97. And then I had to get the Shark Hammer uh, deodorant for $5.97. You're gonna get those three items. So right here, we're gonna get those three items. You are gonna pay $19.91. But Ibotta has two different offers. We currently have 
a, um, sorry you guys, we got a five off a of three that you can get when you buy deodorant and body wash. You also will get a thousand and five points for the Bear Glove body spray, which is four dollars and two cents. I will also get a thousand five points for the regular deodorant, again, four dollars and two cents. Then I get 900 points for submitting my receipt. Now it says right here I can't, but when I go to submit my receipt, there's an option that lets me do it. But I'll get 900 points, which is $3.60 for the uh, body wash. And then I also get a dollar back with the body wash. And then there's a bonus where if you buy one uh, Old Spice and one Olay, you'll get a dollar bonus. But I'll get that also. So you'll end up getting these three items for just $2.27 or 75 cents each. Awesome deal. Okay, so here is the scenario we're gonna do for Olay. So we're gonna get one of the Olays of the special bottle for $8.97. I'm getting the Ceramide. And then I'm getting the Ultra Moisture of the regular Olay. Now make sure you are scanning it on Ibotta because some of them are kind of wonky. Now my shop kick changed since I left the house. But anyways, you're gonna buy these two. You will pay $15.94. But there is currently three Ibotta rebates. So we're gonna get a dollar back for each one of these for a dollar back with Ibotta. You'll get $2 back for this bottle right here with Ibotta, and then you'll get $5 back when you buy two. So you'll get $5 back. That's three Ibotta rebates that you will get, okay? Then um, I get 610 kicks when I purchase this, which is $2.40. It was 900 this morning and it changed, but I'll get 610 kicks. And then I don't have any, it, I don't have anything for the Olay. I did, it disappeared. But, so pay $15.94, you'll get the three Ibotta rebates. I'll get $2.40 back with shop kicks, making these both just 90 cents or 45 cents each. Plus I get that dollar bonus that I get with the Old Spice deal, which is an even better deal. So definitely go ahead and get some Olay. Also make sure you submit your receipts to the PNG website uh, so you guys get your bonus points for that too. So here we have the Bic Razor for $6.92. Uh, you can buy the women's and the men's, but you will pay $6.92 each. We currently have a $5 Ibotta rebate for the men's, and then there's also a $5 rebate for the women's, making these just $1.92, so pretty okay deal if you guys need some razors. So here we have the Neutrogena blush for $6.97. You would pay $6.97, but here we get a $4 Ibotta rebate. They also get a bonus if you buy another item, but there's also a coupons.com rebate that you can also submit your receipt to. That ends up becoming a dollar and a three cent money maker. Here we have the Priscilla Pods. Now I've noticed I've seen the coupons in the Intense Fresh. And right here you can see there is a $2 off coupon that I'll be using. So I'll pay $3.97. But then you can submit your receipt to two or for $2 back with Ibotta, making this just $1.97. So here's a great deal on Clorox bleach. I use this stuff for my couponing. So here we have the No Splash Formula. This is 77 ounces for $5.48. And then we have the Disinfecting Bleach for $5.98. And this is the 81 fluid ounces. Together you're gonna pay $11.46. But there is a couple rebates that we can submit our receipts to. So here we got the dollar rebate with Ibotta. So you'll get $2 back with Ibotta. You also get 500 swag bucks when you purchase the two items. So you get $5 back from swag bucks. You get 410 kicks for the 81 ounces, which is $1.64. And you also get 510 kicks for the 77 ounces. So that is $2.04, making both of these items just 78 cents or 39 cents each, which is an awesome deal. Here is a great deal if you guys need some squeeze uh, dish soap for $1.97. You'll pay $1.97, but here you get a dollar back with Ibotta, making these just, not $1.97, $1.94, but these come out to be just $0.94. Cents. 
awesome deal. They are 14.7 fluid ounces and these are eight. So you get twice the price for that price. Awesome. So here we have the Febreze uh, individual sprays for $3.24. You would pay $3.24, but we currently have a $2.30 Irata rebate, making it just 94 cents, which is a good price to get them for. So here we have the Essential Mist Airwick for $11.98 or $9.98. You're gonna pay either that or the other price, but we currently have a $3 rebate that you can submit to uh, Ibotta, and you get $6 back with the coupons.com app. So this ends up becoming just $2.98, or this one just comes out to be 98 cents. So here we have the Too Good Yogurt for $1.28. You're gonna buy two of them. You will end up paying just $2.56, but then you get 75 cents back with Ibotta, so you'll get two, uh, 75 cents, you get $1.50 back with Ibotta. You can also submit your receipt to the coupons.com app where you'll get a dollar back off of two, making these just six cents or three cents each. So here we have the Betty Crocker uh, cake mix for $1.58. You're gonna buy two of them. You will end up paying $3.68, but then there is a 50 cent Ibotta rebate when you buy two, making these just $2.66 or $1.33. Then we also have the uh, frosting for $1.74. You're gonna buy two of those. You would pay $3.48. And then there is a 75 cents off of two when you purchase those with Ibotta, making your price for that $2.73 or $1.36. But there's actually a deal that you can do with coupons.com. So if you buy two of the frostings and two of the cake mix, you will pay $6.64. You will get the 50 cents off of two back for the uh, the cake. You'll get the 75 cents off of two for the frosting. But you can also submit your receipt for a dollar off of three back with coupons.com, making it $4.39 or just a dollar nine each, which is a great deal if you guys need some cake. So here we have the Kinder's uh, barbecue sauce. Now make sure you scan some because some of them only work for certain deals. But anyways, they're three dollars and ninety-eight cents. You're gonna buy two of them. You would pay seven ninety-six. But then we have an Ibotta rebate where you get three ninety-eight back when you purchase the two. There is a bonus, but it looks like it has to be done in two separate shopping trips where you'll get an additional dollar fifty. But these end up becoming just three dollars and ninety-eight cents or a dollar ninety-nine each, which is a pretty decent deal. I really want to try the garlic parmesan. So I'm going to do this deal because I have a bonus for it, but we're going to get the Luigi's Italian Ice for $2.98. You would pay $2.98 for it, but then there is an Ibotta rebate for $0.84, cents, so you'll get that for just $2.13, and then I have a bonus where if I buy one more item from last week, then I'll end up getting a dollar bonus, so it ends up coming just $1.13, which is a pretty decent deal. So here we have these Talente uh, Sorbetto bars, I can't pronounce it. My store showed that they had more, so I gotta walk around some more. But anyways, these are $4.98, you would pay $4.98, but then there's a deal that does end today with uh, Fetch Rewards, where you'll get 1,500 points, which is $1.50. And I also have two Ibotta rebates, so I'll get $1.50 for this one, and then I also get $1.50 back. So you get uh, $3 back with uh, Ibotta, making these just $40. Eight cents, which is an awesome deal. And if you haven't tried those, definitely try those. So my kids love these swirl sticks for three dollars. You're gonna pay three dollars for it, but then there is a seventy-five cent I bought a rebate, making these just two dollars and twenty-five cents. And there is twelve of them in the box, so that is a pretty decent deal. 
a deal that we can do. We have the brown berry for three dollars and forty-eight cents. This deal, this does end possibly today, but you get a thousand points for every dollar that you spend. So most likely it could be free because um, we're spending three forty-eight. So we might get three thousand and four hundred and eighty points. So this might be an easy freebie. So definitely check it out if you guys can with the Fetch Rewards app. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So yes, I'm pretty excited. Like when I go couponing on Thursdays, I have literally less than like an hour and a half, give or take, to shop because I have to go pick up my daughter from preschool. And I couldn't believe like I got done super early. Well, not super early, but I got done like time to like just not have not a free go where I got to go pick up my daughter. But so that was pretty good. So my total, you guys came to a hundred and forty three dollars and eighty one cents a hundred and forty three dollars and eighty one cents i only used one paper coupon and that was for the persil um i could not get that thing open i was like trying to uh, my fingers hurt i'm trying to take the cover off the cover they seal it shut and then there's also the like the top I'm trying and I'm trying and I'm trying. I'm like, I just want this coupon, you know? And so I finally got that open and I'm just like, I'm going to try using the pods. I've always used the liquid, um, but I'm going to try using the pods and see how well they would do. Um, but I really love Priscilla and it's hard to coupon for Priscilla, especially in my area because we don't get those coupons. So yes, but $143.81. I did mess up. Um, the Old Spice Body Wash. Now, I didn't read that you need to get certain ones for the uh, Ibotta rebate. So there is the three of uh, the $5 off of three. That one works just fine. But then there is the $1 Old Spice Body Wash. This did not work it. And I thought I scanned it, but apparently I did it. And they have a list of certain scents that you can get. So make sure you check the scents on the Old Spice uh, I bought a rebate and then make sure you check in the scents on the shop kick and I don't know if there's two of the same ones I don't know but that's okay but I didn't get the dollar rebate for that and then I also did not get the dollar bonus for the Olay and the Old Spice which it sucks but that's okay I'm still happy with everything that I got so I did get the shark hammer which works for the shop kick but it doesn't work for the Ibotta. So just giving you guys a heads up. I ended up getting two of those Gain Squeeze uh, soaps because I really like the blue one, but I also liked the green one. So I'm like, we're gonna get two of them. I mean, for 94 cents, you couldn't go wrong with that. And I hope that deal resets, but most likely the P&G rebates very seldomly ever reset. And I wish it did because I should have gotten five because 94 cents for that pot bottle would have been a great, great deal. So now I know if that deal pops up, I'm maxing out my savings for that. Um, the Airwick was an awesome deal. Now, um, what was I trying to say? The only thing I really wanted to get, and I did this deal last week, was those Olay deals. I did like these two facial products, which I don't think I have near me. I have them on the floor. But there is these Olay uh, Regenerous things that were $9.97. My store said that they had them, but the shelf was empty. But they were $9.97. There's two different kinds. You would get both of those and then you would get $10 back off of two from Ibotta. And then there is a $10 uh, bonus that you would get. So you would actually get both of those for free. If you want to see what I did, I did the deal last week. So check out my deal. But that was a great deal too. I wanted to do that. But my store was sold out. Um... The Kinder Barbecue, I wanted to get a couple different flavors, but again, it's only for particular flavors, which is okay. But everything else went out fine. The Arnold Bread, um, like I said, it does end today, but it might reset. I've noticed with Fetch, sometimes it like resets again. But you get a thousand points for every dollar you spend. So I actually did get, since it was $3.48, I actually did get... 3,480 points. So I did get that for free. Um, I think maybe they're doing it that way now because it makes it look like it's not for free because everybody always goes for those freebies. Um, but I think like something kind of like that. So I ended up getting that bread for free. So that was a great deal with that. But uh, my total again was $143.81. I only used that $2 off paper coupon from the Persil. I did receive 
$59.63 back with Ibotta. $59.63. I've gotten more from that. I think the one time I've ever gotten is like 80, $80 from Ibotta. Yes, I go hardcore when I do my Ibotta hauls, but 59.63. Fetch rewards, I received 5,252 points, which is $5.25. Uh, Swagbucks, I did receive. Now, if you didn't know about this, Swagbucks does have a lot of options for like any brand stuff so there I don't have them all checked off and I should but they have like Old Spice on there they have Pepsi they have Coke they have Lay they have like a ton of things and I had Old Spice on there so I actually got five cents for buying the Old Spice so make sure you check those off I am still working on some videos I know a lot of you guys are asking me to do videos on how to do this how to do that I am working on the videos I have a lot of them made already but I only am posting one a week I'm also posting tutorials and all that stuff and I'm trying to post those once a week too and then I'm also getting ready for some taste tests. I love doing taste tests and I found two items today, well technically three videos worth of taste tests that I'm going to try so you guys will definitely want to check that out. Um, so I'm just trying to bring as much content to my channel as possible you know, so you guys can try stuff out but giving you a heads up with that. Uh, Shop Kicks, I received 4000 I think I received 4,700 points. I can't see if that's a one. I think it's a seven. So I got 4,700 points, which is $18.80. Coupons.com, I submitted my receipt to for all that stuff, and I got $20 back with Coupons.com. $20 back. Now, you can do Coupons.com or you can do Shopium. So however you guys want to do it, unless you get two items, then you can do one or the other. Now, there is Alexa. There's the Amazon app. I do have a video on how you guys can do that. That's one video that I'm not posting a new one because I just recently posted that. But um, they didn't have every single deal that coupons.com had. Usually it's the same stuff. So I only did like three deals with Amazon and I got 12, I'll got i be getting $12 back. And that is where I get, uh, it'll go directly to my account. So I got it for the Airwick. I got it for the, um, uh, the Airwick. The tooth the Colgate toothpaste and I also got it for the poise they didn't have Kotex on there they didn't have the too good in there the Neutrogena would not scan for the item that I got um, so and they didn't have any of the Betty Crocker deals so just giving you guys a heads up but I did get uh, $12 back with Amazon I did finish uh, the frozen item, so I got that dollar bonus for buying that frozen item. I only needed 24 rebates for that derby bonus, but I got five bucks for that. And then I did finish my weekend warrior where I got uh, five items, so I got one dollar for that. So I'm happy with everything that I got. Um, my grand total, you guys, came to be $16.08. I ended up getting 31 items at 51 cents each, which is a pretty good deal. Um, I'm really trying to get more food deals because with the prices going up these days and just everything in general, I'm trying to get as much bang for my buck. So you guys will see me pushing more food deals and stuff like that. But for 16 bucks for everything that I got, I ended up getting 31 items. I'm pretty happy with that. Considering my most expensive item that I got was the Airwick, and that was $11.98. And normal people pay that price. We don't pay that price, but normal people pay that price. And then that Colgate toothpaste was $10 bucks also. So $16.08 for 31 items. I ended up saving $129.73. $129.73. Um, make sure you guys are submitting your receipt to the PNG app. Now, I know it comes and goes for those gift cards, but... As long as you keep, you know, submitting receipts, which I slack at big time. Make sure you guys are submitting your receipts so you guys can get money off of that. Um, and I think the Betty Crocker stuff might go towards the box tops. Um, I will be making a video on the box tops app because it's free money. But I think we get, so I will get money. Okay, it's Lysol, not Clorox. I was thinking Clorox. Um... No, nothing that I got today was go would go towards the um, other thing. So my husband's calling me. But anyways, that was everything that I got. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Hopefully you guys can get some awesome savings. And I will see you guys next week for another hopefully awesome Walmart haul. See you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.